So I have to ask you a question that I don't know that I really want the answer to. Um, but did, he, did my uncle kill him? And you know what? I just, can you hear me? Okay, because I don't have you, I don't have your image up for some reason. Hang on. Oh, okay, there it is. I got it. You want me to download it? It didn't go to download. Let me see. Let me see what happens here. Wait a minute. I should save it to a local disk, right? Oh, there, there you are. I just found you. Why is it just going to my libraries? Let me see. Yeah, I got it. Oh, wow. The young guy. Oh, wow. Oh. I mean, he looks exactly like Uncle Bud, but they're just two different races, you know? I mean, that's really hard to deal with. And that's, and that's the daughter that I sent it to. Oh, I want to cry. Oh, wow. But she looks just like me. Oh, look at her. Bless her heart. I'm so glad we did this. I can't tell you how glad I am. Okay. I'm going to download this one. Let's see what happens with that. Okay. You were hidden behind something else. Oh, it looks like something's happening on my end. Okay, here it is. Photo from Japan. Okay. Yeah, I got it. Oh, wow. I'm reading it right now. Dear Mrs. Dion M. Blazing, I have unexpectedly received the flag of my father, Nori Atsu Yamaguchi. By virtue of your thoughtful offer and support by Hobon Society. Thank you very much. This year marks 75th anniversary after the war ended and was also my father's 110th birthday. I felt this proved his strong desire to come home because his flag returned home just before his birthday, October the 26th. My father went to war in April of 1944 as army captain, and the following year he died in the Battle of Luzon Island of Philippines in April of 1945. I was nine years old at the time, and fortunately, I could remember his voice and figure. However, my mother and his brothers, as well as his parents, all passed away. Now, I am the only person who keeps my father's memory. I think it was very lucky your uncle, Mr. Neil Bud Hurd, found my father's flag in the middle of war and brought it to Michigan. I truly appreciate he preserved it very carefully. The flag has little stain or damage, even though it must have been carried through the battlefield. I am thinking about Mr. Hora's thoughtfulness, looking at his photos. I heard my father was shot in his stomach and then later killed himself. When I think what was passing through his mind before he died, I am sure it was of my mother and me. I look at my father having returned home and wonder if he finds me acceptable to be his daughter. With your generous help, my father with his flag finally could reach a place to rest in peace after 75 years long journey. On the night his flag returned, almost as if my father rubbed his cheek against my cheek after a long time, I held the flag in the chest 
and fell into a shallow sleep trying to control my emotion. Such reunion with my father would have never happened without your uncle's thoughtful towards the flag and your arrangement. I announced the return of the flag to my late mother at the family grave. Under COVID-19 pandemic, please take good care of yourself. With sincere gratitude, from Noriko Koishi, maiden name Yamaguchi. Oh, that's, <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Can you still hear me? Yeah. Um, uh, I don't even know what to say. I'm so glad. I'm so glad that I, I found your webpage. I'm so glad. I'm so glad we did this.